I'm Dave Martin here for AvWeb's Light Sport Mall, here to talk about the RANS S7. This airplane is a little unusual in the special factory built Light Sport aircraft field because it was designed and is built here in the United States. The S7 was Randy Schlitter's seventh design, and he's all the way up to 19 now. The S7 is available still in several versions of the amateur built kit. But it's also available factory manufactured. You can buy it just as it is here. Let's take a closer look. The cockpit of the RANS S7 is conventional, except that the uh, throttle is a bit lower because of the two wide doors that Randy mentioned. Randy, why don't you give us some details about the configuration of the panel? Well, the panel, as you can see, is not a, an extra large piece of real estate, and uh, we got lucky with the uh, shrinking of avionics. This one features a Dynon uh, digital panel plus uh, a 396 and a transponder and a radio. So basically everything, everything you would actually need has now been shrunk conveniently uh, and in time for us to have a nice panel for this plane. Traditionally, we had a heck of a time trying to get a full day FR in here. As Randy knows, I'm really favorably impressed with the RANS S7. Tell us a little bit about the options for the for the uh, aircraft, Randy. Well, that's one of the nice things about the 7, Dave. We've got uh, a very complete kit. The options are few. I think you can uh, boost it to the bush tires and uh, some lights and uh, maybe a couple of propeller choices, and that's about it. Well, of course, one of the major options is you could build it and license it okay, as, a, those as amateur options. build. Yes, there yeah. are options there that uh, are plenty. Yeah, you can buy it in a partial kit. There's seven different kits, uh -huh. and then you can buy it as a standard kit, getting the whole kit. What would be the range of prices of the standard kit and then the S7 uh, right. LSA, S, uh, factory build You'll LSA. have uh, 21 in the kit and about 4,000-something in your engine install and 17 in your engine so you'll be in the high 40s and then you can buy a quick build kit that adds about 16 and then you can buy a ready to fly that is uh, 91. Very good. This is Dave Martin for the Light Sport Mall.